We interrupt your regularly scheduled geeking out for more Missing Link for, uh, see what is this for? Onward into a cutscene. Oh, yes. Welcome to the edge. Technically, we can't say it's 64 because this is exactly a ROM hack. Yeah. Well, depending on if you can know how to load ROM, load your own ROMs into Deku hardware Grove. for for PC, if you know where who to ask. Welcome to the end of Deku Road. Oh, oh I don't think I've heard that. I've heard that sound effect oh. in a long time. Please listen closely, Rinku. I feel that I fear this may be the last time we are able to speak like this. Oh, already? already? For the last time, my name's Laddie. Look around and observe. <laughs> Not in this universe, it ain't. Wrong age. This forest may be at first glance to be uh, simply a peaceful dwelling. Uh huh. Yet I can sense the presence of the fairies. They are nearby. Oh. That is not all I sense, though. Are you sure we must feel it too? The darkness creeping towards us. The demon. Unspeakable. It's evil. almost as if, if you listen closely. Oh. Oh. You can hear their cries. Fairies don't sound like that. That just sounds like Zelda again. Oh. When I heard Hello. the demon was nearing the forest, I left to stop him. I wanted to protect all of our fairies. Oh. So yeah, I think that. As you can see, concept. though, I failed and nearly lost my life. Rather than die useless death, I sealed my sword within the sword and waited for you. Hmm. I waited for you, Rinku, to return. Just like I just knew you would. I'm sorry I couldn't be of any more help to you, but I'm glad we spent this time. So please, give this adventure a hopeful end. I'll be there beside you. Hmm. Always. So wait, how would this explain her actions in, in, in the future? What do you mean? I mean, we're technically, you know, she says she's still, she's still the sage, the uh, force sage, isn't she? Uh, that's in a different timeline. That's right, we are still technically in the, the altered timeline. That, which, you know what? That also does remind me of another thing that they can, that, you know, they announced at the very end of this recent direct that Bayonetta 3 isn't dead. <laughs> and that, you know, there's a lot of speculation, and honestly, I can totally believe it that the Bayonetta you see in that cut in that trailer is actually of the altered timeline with, uh, well,. Explaining it now would actually be a spoiler because, spoiler to the events of the first game, because we are planning on doing that for the channel at some point or other, so I'll keep my yap shut there. You know what? Deku nut milk for 40 rupees. I will say, though, if that's the case, that probably would explain why um, Helena Taylor mentioned she wouldn't be reprising for Bayonetta. Right. That is, for all we know, that's likely a, di like a different timeline Bayonetta, as opposed to the one we've come to know in the first two games. So what do you guys think of the music? Very good, I will say. Like, I, I can't think of... I don't think I've heard the Ocarina of, of Time oh, like, sound font so lively. Yeah. Like, actually, I want to ask that. Is there much of a difference between the sound fonts for Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask? No, there, there's... If there are, there... There's a little bit of a difference. I was about to say, if there are is a difference, it's very subtle. Like, it's probably yeah. still the same thing at the end of the day, just slightly uh, touched up. Um, take it from me, who... It likes to edit MIDI in those sound fonts. Um, they are similar but different. I downloaded both packs for Ocarina of Time and the George Mask. Honestly, it's very it's very much the same procedure like going in for Mars 64 to Ocarina of Time because technically they both share more or less the same same assets. Yep. Okay. Just that Ocarina of Time and the Mask. I like what they Mask. did for the cave theme here. Oh yeah, no, this is pretty nice. No, what were you trying to say, James? Again, it's just a matter of they probably added on to what they already had with with the previous uh, stuff. We got a try. bug for a reason. Why are we going to scare? Or are we going to scare the pants out of one particular kid, Deku Scrub, who's hiding in prop in the hole? We need to go down. <laughs> nah. I yeah, mean, we're gonna you to think it of it as I mean, see, aside from when he, you know, in the Majora's Mask, when he does end up becoming a Deku himself, has Link ever tried like? Has Link ever tried to dive into a Deku hole? Uh, no. Welcome to the rarity shop. I open my shop in the Deku Forest. So I can get lots of yummy Deku nuts. What do you Would you like to trade your Deku like? nuts for a bunny hood mask? Huh? How about 20 Deku nuts? I... You know, I'm surprised we actually have a use for those those uh, flash bombs. Yep. Yeah. Actually, I'm kind of curious. It also allows you to run faster and jump higher. Sweet. Thank you for trading with me. 
I was about to say that. That kind of makes me curious. Like, what do you think a Deku nut would taste like? A nut? I'm kind of curious about that too, honestly. Well, the, here's the thing. There's technically multiple kinds of nuts. True. I mean, it, it would have to have some sort of, uh, for lack of a better word, zest to it, considering it is the type that can be used as a literal uh, flashbang. Uh, what say you on the matter, Logan? Superman 64. <laughs> Boy, that would be a mess and a half to even think about. Yeah, fine, that's, fine. that's, that's gonna oh. be, that'll be hard on legal issues alone. Also, to me, they always kind of looked like chestnuts. They or not did, chestnuts, yes. or not, or, yeah, actually, yeah, no, they, yeah, I, I could see them tasting like chestnuts. Yeah. yeah. I mean, oh, water chestnuts. Come? Yeah. Hey there, would you like to visit my Deku Baba garden? What? It's a it's a one of a kind garden. Oh, nice freebie. Of Deku Babas. So this ah. is pretty much a place you can farm for Deku nuts if you don't have the right amount. Oh, to get the bunny hood, okay. Oh. And uh, okay. and yeah, uh, I appreciate. Usually this uh, bunny hood mechanic is something you only really can see if you're playing a randomizer in which they alter the values. But yep, now it uh, functions as you will later see it doing in Majora's Mask. And more except, famously, uh, except hmm? it's it's actually more broken in this because um you you'll see just remember how it said that it'll make you jump higher. Yeah. Like it literally makes you jump as high as Mario. Uh, almost. But as soon as Celia gets around to it, she will show it off. Yep. I just There's wanted to feed all the Deku Babas here. Oh, I would say it. it would be nice if there ever was like a ROM hack that just gave you a straight up jump button. Though we already have Breath of the Law for a Zelda, for a Zelda like a natural hopping experience, so. Right. Yeah. Alright, so uh, I think that's all of them, so yeah, you got all your rupees, now what are you gonna do about it? Here we go, let's get that heart piece over there. Oh, oh. boy! Alright, let's see how broken or how much momentum Make we got. Make like a rabbit, and wait! Wow. Damn, that's... I that's told you. that's that's a literal that's a <laughs> look that's a literal that's a literal long jump. You got long jumping skills now. Seely, Seely, you have to answer this now. Can Link pull off the backwards long jump trick? Yeah. Nope. Damn. Damn. <laughs> Damn. One. Which day. actually, now that I think about it, the version of R64 they are using for the uh, NSO app is going to be the rate well. For the Western version, at the very least, is going to be the the base version that we got, so that long yes. drop trick can still work. I can do I, it. I, I don't want a deck of for fifteen rupees. That's overpriced. Screw you then. <laughs> Oh, yeah, in Master of Time, if you didn't buy something from a deck of scrub in the castle town, he'll go, uh, fine, go to hell then. Jesus. Uh. Okay. You didn't say um, that literally, right? He did, actually. He did in, wait, in Majora's Mask? No, no Master, Master of Time. No, Master of Time. Oh, well, okay. You know that, that, Master that makes, be the, yeah. Yeah, Master of Time is going to be that game that we keep bringing up because of how astonishingly weird it was, but just know that we're not like covering it because it's just... No, we're not. Seeley can say, say it from experience. Tara can say it from experience. That game is just the literal definition of try hard. Yeah, and, it's, it's, it's 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 too long for one. One would one would argue that our best our best service would be to not give it any more attention, but it just sometimes keeps baffling Seely. For now, we it's the know, music. For now, we can jump long across. Oh, you mean how the music sounds drunk? Woo. I liked how we did some of the MIDI edits. But there were <laughs> official other songs. Hey, welcome to Cuckoo Farm. Uh, actually, it's a uh, Cluck Cluck Branch. Not as successful as its lawn lawn cousin, but they make do. Ah, look I at like the cluck music, cluck though. chickens doing their cluck cluck chickenings. Well, uh, let's see what kind of chickening business we can get up to. Ooh. Hype, you stay out of it. <laughs> uh, um, what? that didn't work. Oh, the, you thought you could get in that way, you big silly. All right, <laughs> fine, we'll do it the other way. Around. I thought you were going to call me a cheater. <laughs> no, you You're a it. cheater. You just have to unlock the passageway. See, also, he's a so, cheater. Also, sorry, Hype. I did not mean that against you personally. It was just—it was about your family's chicken in business. And it just had to be called into question. Oh, fairy boy, you're back! Wow, is that the hero shield on your back? Also, oh, Lily is bound. You must have oh. been on an heroic adventure. I guess Epona she. Epona has been out. missing oh. you. Take her out sometime. I'm sure she wouldn't mind going on an adventure with you. You cannot. 
I have an idea. What if you and Pona raced each other? She has what? been getting very fast. Actually, now that I think about it, that is probably one plot point they could have elaborated on further, is the fact that Link technically earned Epona back when he was an adult, but as a child, yeah, never is outright explained how, why he got to keep Epona. Yeah. We'll hopefully learn that here. For now, we're racing a horse. <laughs> well, it's a good thing I have I have the agility of a rabbit. So, <laughs> now, does rolling also make you go faster, or is it mainly you just need to be on foot? I don't know. I just... I, <laughs> I don't think I tried it. I, I feel like rolling does slow you down a bit with the bunny hood. Man, imagine if, if the bunny hood could literally make not only make him go faster, but also essentially treat it like like Metroid Speed Booster, where like at some <laughs> point while running, fast. he just it's up just... and just goes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and the, oh yeah, yeah. Random thought that that direct also showed us that Dread is officially bringing back the Shine Spark. Hey. I think it, I think it was already confirmed. But oh, how'd you get here so quickly? <laughs> I've been here all along. Wow, well, Riku, you did it! Epona sure is fast, but not fast enough for you, it seems. Aww. You cheated, didn't you? As promised, here's your prize for winning the race, Rinku. This is Kojiro, a special blue kind of cuckoo that Kojiro. is blue and extremely brave. Kojiro! Unlike the other cuckoos in this ranch, Kojiro is brave enough to leave and explore Hyrule. How? Wait. He can also fly over long distances and Basically, it's the only explanation. He'll fly back right beside her. Basically, the explanation is that you can't carry your Kuko out of here unless it's Kohiro. Kohiro, you can actually carry outside of this area and go, and because we're going to need him to get to the dungeon. What I'm trying yeah. to remember is that, like, I remember in the Ocarina of Time, he was part of part of the uh, the Begoron Sword side quest. And I'm okay. trying to remember, like, didn't you have to take him to uh, Kuko Lady's older brother? Yeah. But so, otherwise, but otherwise he's so how on earth did he come back here when, you know... He's a legend. Link was an adult when it happened, remember? Oh, yeah, you're All right. this like, dying time man, stuff Man, I is... keep... I keep... That's like the one, you know, missing link when I, whenever I'm thinking of all this stuff. <laughs> that's all right. And it is actually... It is nice, nice to see him out in the open now, because before Have he you noticed the just, cows like, have rings in their nose? Yeah. Uh, yes, I have noticed that. Weren't they not, weren't they not a thing in the original game? I th no, I'll th I'll th think the they wild did cows in uh, them, 3D, but... 3DS, they did. That's true. Oh. That's what I'm thinking of. Because that just makes me think of Which, speaking but... of, ladies and gentlemen, at some point I do still plan on sh doing like a look at of uh, the 3D version of Ocarina of Time to at least show off that game's Master Quest mode. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But I can't outright say when we're going to get to that. It's honestly something that's kind of like the last thing on my mind. I mean, I mean James, I wouldn't mind if you just, you know, made a mini little mini commentary where you just did every dungeon instead of the whole game. Of, of the Master Quest? Are you are you nuts? That would still take a while. Oh, the are you nuts that... about Majora's Mask being live? Fair point. Well made. <laughs> but we'll figure something out. But, but, but Master Quest is it's is a completely different beast. I'd say. Oh, uh, I mean, I so guess if I were to do that, do Master Quest live, then I could at least have Seely be my my literal Navi for that whole thing. Probably. You got a birth certificate. Since you're the only one, only one of a lot of us who were crazy enough to actually go through it. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, the only real difference is that for the 3DS version, they also outright mirror the entire game map. Right. <laughs> so, now that we hopefully can now have a nice, explorable uh, Kohiro. Kojiro. Hello, old lady. Kojiro. Kojiro. We have to handle a silly issue like the Deku. Okay. Uh, hi. Are you there? Clayfighter 63 and a half. That could <laughs> also work. Are you still work. on that? Yes, <laughs> I would also play that as well. Also, I was going to say, sorry about bringing your chicken in business into question. Honestly, I would only just play. I would only just play that just for the novelty of it all, not because it's actually not because it's a good game, because it's not. <laughs> to be fair, that's what a lot of people would passive aggressively say for the last handful of SNES entries. Yeah, that's true. I mean, it's funny because a good handful of games, actually, a funny coincidence. Yeah, like a handful of uh, Super NES games they've added to the service were from Interplay. I didn't mean to talk to her. I was trying to grab him. You're a little too close for comfort there, Kojiro. Come on. But yeah, We're not um, quite done here yet. Yeah, technically Interplay does own the rights to Play Fighter, so they could probably do it, assuming they really want to. I mean, it would definitely it definitely would cause a little bit of buzz, considering that Play Fighters it does have a slight cult oh, following. Oh, little fun Again, fact here. Just for the just for the irony of it all. Little fun fact here: when I first went in there before they released a patch, that the game actually crashed on me when I went in there. Oops. Goodness. Remember that, Logan. <laughs> Yeah. You were went to the no man's land, Seely. Yeah, be a little more careful than that. A freaking cow stool. Uh, 
cow stool. I mean, isn't that usually where cows do their business in the hay? Huh. Fair. Uh, so, if we go Don't think here, about that. <laughs> this is this is our secret passage out of but here. But Seely, we need the cow pies to fuel our spacesuit. What was the purpose of us doing that again? Going out the back door? Uh, shortcut? I don't know. I mean, that's just, that's, I mean, you, you came for, you came in from the rooftop, so. Oh, okay, nice. Yeah, yeah okay. remember we went in there before and it was blocked? So, before we go on with the quest, Seely got that birth certificate and we have the bunny hood, which could help us get to that heart piece that was in the Kokiri, like, house. Yep. So it's just out of reach. So, just real quick, is all this forest still technically all a part of the uh, Lost Woods, or is it just its own separate thing? I, get th I think it's like a connection, like, maybe like on the other, like, opposite outskirts of the forest. Because, boy, would, yeah. that, would that be shitty luck if the Kuko lady was literally, you know, wait, take, stealth, taking your sweet time to wait? Exactly. You're not a stealth host, are you? Into his, like, speaking of which. Okay. Thank you, you for finding the birth certificate. I want to have this piece of heart for helping me. Ah, uh, okay, so it's a side quest. Yep. Okay. So with that, we're only halfway done from getting all of our hearts. We have two more heart pieces we need to get, and I know exactly where to find the other two. Oh, oh. boy. We're going to go back to Monktown Valley because we missed a piece of heart back there. You know, say if they ever do put Game Boy Advance games uh, as part of that expansion pack service, imagine if they end up putting A Link to the Past flat slash Four Swords and are, and are able to find a way to get multiplayer to work through that. Oh, right here. This was another bug, no pun intended, that they had to fix. Hmm. Because I put the bug in there and I'm like, what was the point of that? Uh, nothing's happening. But uh, they forgot to do this. Oh. 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 <laughs> there you go. Okay, just pop. I was ex I was honestly expecting just another scared shitless golden skulltula. Yeah. Okay, that was a cool transition there. Ooh. But yeah, no, it also. But yeah, go back real quick. It's like imagine that if again, if they do put GBA games as part of that expansion pack service, and they're able to test further the capabilities of doing multiplayer through it. Yeah. It'd be a slightly more intricate setup, considering you know you need a game link cables to do multiplayer on the GBA, but still. Then would we get to have our escapades in the amazing mirror ceiling? <laughs> Though, assuming it doesn't happen within the next, I don't know, year or so, we're planning to, we're going to try oh, dabbling into some, some you know, special tech in order to do that through, you know, the usual. Yeah. Go! Yay. That's it. That's our last heart. Hooray! Now we can get the heck out of here. We did, uh... So now we're to... Uh, no we have wood. to go back. Oh, well, it's a good thing you have the bunny hood, otherwise that would have been very tedious. Yep. Fine. So why exactly do they have two separate um, branches again? I don't know. Kind of thinking, what, how is that old Talon doing? Talon's not even here. Wow. He just, le he just leaves his daughter daughter all by his, all her lonesome, taking care of all the all the cuckoos. <laughs> Great. I mean, that's... That, I mean, the, oh, go oh, Cheryl! Kojiro, my friend. <laughs> Kojiro, my friend. My Susan, how could you leave me like that? You survived, Rosa. Oh God. <laughs> I don't think you were with us when we were watching that episode, Seely, but <laughs> El Rosa is in... a wonder over yonder reference. Oh, okay. I was there's that, and I was and I was thinking of Jellystone with um, El Cabong's portrayal in that, and you know. Right. How he, lo how he calls his guitar Susan. We should watch that again. Much yeah. more of that, I mean. And just that depressive episode he has when Susan dies. Yeah. Oh, which by the way, uh, yeah, join us in, in the next part. I think it's the finale? Yep. Mm -hmm. Next part's the finale, and it's a long one, so... Fasten your seatbelts, kids! I was about to say, given how long it is, I, I, I hope it's the finale. So, yeah, until next time, guys. Bye! Bye. Uh,